get your knit on. The Well is hosting a community knit-a-thon on September 30th with all handmade items being donated to St. Mark Margaret's house. And Lindsay is joining us this morning with the details and with the sweet threads that we have here. Absolutely. <laughs> Lindsay, thank you for bringing all of us, all of this to really show us what's happening yes. coming up very soon. Yes. So can you tell me a little bit about The Well and St. Margaret's house? Because these are two great organizations that you're really benefiting. Absolutely. The Well is a nonprofit coffee shop located in the River Park neighborhood of South Bend mm -hmm. and we share our profits with worthy nonprofits in the community doing great work. So that means every time you buy a cup of coffee or you come to an event, the proceeds from that go to a great cause. Yes. And each month we adopt a community partner of the month and this month it is St. Margaret's House which is an incredible organization doing great work for women in need in the community and their children. And so we're doing a knit-a-thon at the end of the month to benefit uh, them. Yes, okay, let's look at some of these pieces yes. that we brought in here. Yeah. So what exactly, tell me a little bit of the story behind these. Okay, so it's the important beautiful. thing that we want people wow. to know is that you don't have to be a professional knitter oh, to come good. to our event, <laughs> or even a knitter. You could be a crocheter or a sure. loom knitter here. Um, but this is an extremely intricate um, scarf that we have, and then this is the first scarf I ever made. Okay, and let's the, hold these yes. up for comparison. Yeah. And so the point is, they're both warm. Yes. We don't need, like, we love the cables. They're beautiful. They're absolutely beautiful. But you don't have to be a professional knitter <laughs> to come to our event. We want anybody who's from a hobbyist to a beginner to be able to come and support um, these wonderful women and knit or crochet a beautiful item for them to wear this winter. Well, they are so, really, they're both so comforting. Yes. I think that that's the beautiful thing, absolutely. too. And as I see him here, you know, you said they are both warm. They certainly yes. are. Yes. <laughs> Yes. And I love that you brought all of this here yep. too. So is this something that's a little bit more beginner friendly that somebody could pick up? Or it's just something it's different. So mm -hmm. it's called loom knitting and you go in a mm. circle around and you use a little hook and it it's the same product in the end. Um, I've met a woman once who could do five or six in an evening with this hat wow. or scarves. It's very fast. A lot of youth use this mm -hmm. um, or maybe if you have arthritis and aren't able to use a hook or needles, you can use this tool. So those are very popular as well. We want you to come if this is what you use, if you use a uh, crochet hook or if you even want to bring your sewing machine, let us know ahead of time and we'll get you some electricity. I love that. That's excellent. Yes. Okay, and then we have this sweater over here on our yes. little mannequin friend. Yes. And this is something, so you can also knit something before yes. this event, right? So Absolutely. tell me about this. So these mm. pieces were um, already donated. It was knitted ahead of time by one of our lovely participants. I'd never met her before and she came bringing in the haul a few weeks ago. And it was just wonderful to go through and think about all the hours of love that went into each piece. Yes. And that's exactly what we want to do with this event is, you know, there's there's a moment where you get underneath a cozy handmade quilt or you put on a scarf and it was made out of love. And mm -hmm. we want to fill every item that we donate to St. Margaret's House with love for those who are wearing them. Right. I mean, it really is that element of comfort that you're yes. providing, which is so important. And I'm sure this is a great mm -hmm. way for people who love knitting or crocheting yes. or using this tool right yes. over here to come out and kind of build a community. Mm -hmm. So Absolutely. what are you kind of expecting with that? And can people just sign up or mm -hmm. can they just show up right on the day? Well, we have a Facebook event going. If you'd be willing to say that you're attending, that would be mm -hmm. helpful to us. But um, we're just expecting a community of crafters to show up and we're going to knit crochet for 10 hours. You oh. don't have to stay the full time. It's from noon until 10, but during that time, we have a lot of community building activities. Um, we're going to have some door prizes, like this great candle that was donated mm -hmm. to us from Crim Enchantments. Um, we have some other fun door prizes. We're going to have live music um, at a certain a couple points during the day. We also are going to have a waffle bar during dinner. Oh, so well, if, that's excellent. <laughs> if you're not a knitter or crocheter and you just want to pop in to hang out, come get waffles, enjoy live music, um, cheer on our crafters, and it's just going to be a day where our crafting community which is rather large because we have a craft night on Thursday nights, which is where this event was born. Mm -hmm. um, we just want everybody to come together, bring in new friends, and really uh, do something great for St. Margaret's House. Well, and let's say you're not a knitter or a crocheter, mm -hmm. but you still want to help. How could you kind of get involved? Absolutely. We're also taking donations of washable yarn. You can bring those by the well during regular business hours, which are Tuesday to Friday, 6 to 10. Um, or you can leave a cash donation at the bar and let them know that it's for this event. Um, or like I said, just come in and support during the whole month, get a cup of coffee, um, sit down, read a good book, support uh, St. Margaret's House as the community mm -hmm. partner. Absolutely. Support that great mission. Well, Lindsay, yes. thank you so much You're for welcome. joining us, bringing all of the warm and cozy items this morning. And yes. you can check out the Knit-A-Thon. You can get to be a part of that on Saturday, September 30th. It's happening for those 10 hours, as Lindsay said, 12 p.m. to 10 p.m. Visit thewellriverpark.com or check out their Facebook.